Good morning, everyone. Today I'm going to introduce you to something called word ladders. Word ladders. You see the ladder? So the purpose of these word ladders are to introduce you to some new vocabulary. Now, not all the words are going to be new to you, but you're going to get one or two. You're going to get one for sure here. And I just find it's good because throughout the years that we do these with my students, they're like, oh, my God, I've never heard of that like that. I know one specifically is like a short, a short cut or a nickname for Henry, right? You know anyone named Henry? Nickname for Henry, Hank. A lot of you guys don't know that. It just like blew my mind. So we're going to get started here for today's lesson. And I'm going to try to find a way to save these done ones. That way you can use it for your quizzes, especially these star ones, because those are probably going to be used for your quiz. Just like any ladder, you would start from the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and move this up. And we're going to start at the bottom. And check this out. You go left, right, left, right, left, right. So, and it gives you clues. So the first word you already have is tooth, right? And everybody knows what a tooth is. Okay. So now it says a sound made by a train. You're only going to take away one letter. So for that, it would be toot, toot. Sorry, that's my mom texting me. Don't forget to send the kids their $25. Oh, I did last night, mother. Um, the next one, this is one that you probably don't know. Um, so now you have the word toot. So forget about tooth. That was just number one to get us started. So now you're building off toot. So number two says a black substance that comes from burning wood. Change the first letter. So you know that this one's going to stay the same because you're only changing the first letter. And that answer is soot. I don't think you say suit. I don't think you say suit. You say soot. If you Google that, look that up, S-O-O-T, it comes, that black substance that comes from burning wood. Number three, as quickly as possible, change one letter. So you have S-O-O-T, you're changing it to one letter soon, as quick as possible. A lot of people say ASAP, as soon as possible. The male child of a father and mother. Take away one letter from this word, okay? The male child, as you all know, is called the son, right? Short for Donald. Change one letter. Don. Do you get the idea? Um, I want to do this at least once a week. Um, when we come back to real class, you guys will be doing this every single day. It takes a while to get used to, but it gets fun after a while. You know, the kids will start jumping in. Some are like, man, I couldn't get number six. Contraction of do not. We just talked about contractions. Contractions are when you combine two words like do not into one by using that apostrophe that they have there. And it's don't. D-O-N apostrophe T. So now you have don't. A depression or indentation. No one knows this, so this one's going to probably be on your quiz, too. Change one letter from don't. A depression or indentation, the word is actually in there. Somebody hits you with a shopping cart, you end up having a dent in your car. A dent, depression or indentation. And then last but not least, a tooth doctor. Add three letters to dent, D-E-N-T-I-S-T dentist and voila you have the word ladder so please remember soot and remember dent a depression or indentation so what my quizzes will look like is you'll have all the words on the bottom like you'll have all the words on the bottom and you'll have blank boxes and you hear you have the definition right and you have to write like soot would be here so you have to read the definition a depression or indentation and a black substance that comes from burning wood to remember that vocabulary and you'll see you're going to see eventually that it does help you with vocabulary all right ta-ta for now